People often ask me what inspired me to go and help Ukraine. I could say it was because my father joined up in 1937, knowing that there was going to be a war with Germany and the Nazis. I could say it was because my late parents-in-law lived in what was then Eastern Poland. It's now um, Western Ukraine, a town called Drohobych in the Oblast, where they were forced to leave um, because of the joint Nazi um, and Soviet um, aggression on Poland as a result of the um, Ribbentrop-Molotov Pact. And I could say it's because I was very moved by the um, war in Bosnia, um, the Serbian aggression in the war from 1992 um, to 1995, when I was working for a company which was sending out aid convoys and where drivers of those aid, aid convoys um, were, were sadly killed. But ultimately it came down to me seeing the first two days of a full-scale invasion, um, which started on the full-scale invasion of Ukraine, which started on the 24th of February, two years ago, 2022. It's almost the anniversary now. On the third day, 26th of February, 2022, um, I was sitting quietly in a bar waiting to meet up with my son and some friends. And I had time to catch up on my phone with all the news and what I saw there was truly horrific and was seen, of course, by millions of people all over the world. And during that hour, whilst I was waiting to meet up with my friends, I decided that I wanted to go out and help and support. It became, if you like, a passion, a calling, and one that has not left me um, in the last two years. And for me, this is about the long term. I will be there for as long as there is a need for me to be there to help.